What determines whether a wine is vegetarian or vegan solely comes down to the fining agents used. Given enough time in tank or barrel, wine will fall bright, but this could take months or years. <laughs> and winemakers need to accelerate the process. Consumers expect wine to be clear and stable, and this is achieved through various methods of filtration, fining and stabilisation. Hello and welcome to Wine Tutor TV. I'm Tim Wildman and today we're talking about stabilisation and clarification. Aren't we? <laughs> All wine needs to be protein and tartrate stable, so it remains clear in bottle and is resistant to oxidation and microbial spoilage. Tartrate crystals in wine are made of potassium bitartrate, not tartaric acid, and can precipitate if wine is exposed to low temperatures in bottle. Although essentially harmless, they're considered undesirable. There are four main methods to achieve tartrate and temperature stabilisation. 1. Traditional cold stabilisation. The tank is cooled to just above freezing for one to three weeks. The process is time consuming and can be expensive in energy use. Rapid contact process using seeding of potassium bitartrate crystals, KHT, is much quicker and can reduce the process to a matter of days. The main cost involved in this is the purchase of KHT. This method has the effect of lowering total acidity and raising pH. Two ion exchange, used for high volume, lower quality wines. Three, electrodialysis. This is an effective and precise method, also energy efficient. However, it's costly to set up and operate. Four, crystallization inhibitors, CMC, cellulose gum carboxymethyl, has been legal in the EU since 2009. Also, metatartaric acid. The benefits of these methods is that they have less impact on pH, as well as being labour, time and energy saving compared to the traditional cold stabilisation method. Note, wine treated with CMC must be protein stable, so best used when the wine is packaging ready and is most suitable for whites. Clarification involves the removal of insoluble matter suspended in the wine before bottling. This can include lees, bacteria, proteins, pectins, phenolic matter, tartrates, tannins, stems, seeds, skin and pulp. The degree to which a wine needs to be clarified really depends on price point, style and intended market. Musts can be clarified using pectic enzymes or bentonite. There are two categories of fining agents, organic compounds such as egg whites, casein, gelatin and isinglass, or solid or mineral materials such as bentonite or silica. The choice of fining agent will determine if a wine is vegetarian or vegan friendly. The purpose of fining is to remove soluble substances suspended in wine. Clarity or turbidity is measured in NTUs with below one NTU considered clear. The main fining agents and their uses are as follows. For white wine, bentonite, lees settling, heat stability, protein stability. Gelatin, bitterness, astringency, off flavours from rot. Casein, colour and oxidative taint. Isinglass, astringency, clarity. PVPP, bitterness. Carbon, colour, aroma, flavour. For red wine, gelatin, astringency, off tastes, colour. Egg white, astringency. Filters are used to remove solid particulates. Depth filtration can be used to achieve a coarse or light filtration using either a plate and frame filter or diatomaceous earth, which can also be used pre-fermentation to help clarify musts. Surface filtration, such as cross flow, which is finer, or microfiltration, sterile filtration, which is measured in micron pore size. One micron removes brett, 0.65 microns removes yeast, and 0.5 microns is sterile. Students should be aware that despite all the processing aids available for fining and expensive equipment for filtration, the traditional method of racking is commonly used to achieve clarification and can also aid stabilisation. 
The use of topic-specific vocabulary shows authority. A tag cloud for clarification and stabilization could include the following words or phrases. Fining, filtration, centrifuge, flotation, refrigeration, barrel maturation, racking, cold stabilization, rapid contact stabilization, electrodialysis, metatartaric acid, CMC, pectic enzymes, bentonite, isinglass, casein, PVPP, gelatin, tartrate stable, heat stable. Protein stable, microbiological stable, oxygen stable. The examiner's report says that examples shouldn't be generic, but must be relevant to the statements which they're illustrating. So here are the golden rules for examples in your MW essay. They should be original, relevant, global, accurate, specific, multidisciplinary, insightful and current. Feel free to send your questions by email or Twitter. Thanks for watching. Study smart, stress less.